Oh, wait, okay, got it. We, we didn't need to plug it in. Okay, fabulous. Okay, so imagine you want a fountain in your backyard, in your front yard, in your side yard, or near you, wherever you like to sit, because I like to sit and relax outdoors, but the sound of fountain water is always relaxing. This one is sale priced at $167.18. It's $35 less than QVC's price. So you're saving 35, paying 167, or five payments of 33.44. Sale prices don't last very long. So I don't know when it's going back up to the QVC price. What's special about this, it's made by Bernini and they bring us the majority of our beautiful fountains. This one is called the Calvary and, and this one is the copper. Look, we have seven dozen left in the patina copper. We also have an antique gold, which we will show you. 150 in that antique gold. We've sold 1,500 just in this spring season. And so not that many left. You're getting a sale price because we're moving it out. We'll bring more in next year, but right now we're winding down in our spring season. Um, I want to bring in uh, Ginger Walt because Ginger brings us the Bernini's fountains. This one, we had the other fountain earlier, which is beautiful. And that one was 34 and a half inches or 36 and a half inches. This one's just a little taller, 38 inches, a little bit wider at 22 inches diameter. The other one is 20 inches in diameter. But I will say that this one has 16 places where the water comes out <laughs> or runs, runs down. Hi, Ginger. <laughs> Hi, Mary Beth. How are you, sweetheart? Nice to see you. <laughs> Wonderful. Now, yeah, the, um, the I'm one so we had before was yes. uh, run on batteries. This one is electric, correct? Yes, it is, because some of you have asked for a, a fountain that will run all day, all night, 24 hours a day, that they don't have to worry about, you know, going and getting D batteries or recharging mm -hmm. a battery. You wanted right. a plug and play. That's what this one is. It is a statement piece, definitely, for your garden. As you said, it, it, takes up a, it goes up a little bit taller than yeah. some of the other ones. It starts here with this beautiful pineapple finial. Yeah. Now, that top pineapple finial is just stunning. You know what? Let me turn my camera just a smidge because I want you to be able to see that bubbling water that comes up magically yeah. and then spills down the different layers of the pineapple. Mine is the antique gold, which looks absolutely as rich as rich can be. Yeah. There are there are eight channels that are right at that finial at that top part, and then eight channels down here that the water flows down into. But if you take notice to the bottom part of the basin where the birds uh, yes. like to go in that little bird bath. Right. We made this the same design with that cut out as you have on the top tier. Yeah. This is the only one that we have with that beautiful three tiers, but of course the 16 spouts right. with this fountain is what really makes it absolutely spectacular yeah. from the top to the very bottom. It looks aged, doesn't it? It does, but it, again, it looks statuesque. It really yes. has a great look. It doesn't look like you just threw some tin cans together and got a fountain. This one is very regal. You want to up the, the quality of your home if you're trying to sell your home. You put this out front and all of a sudden people drive up and they're like, whoa. And the thing is, is that if you've ever been to a place where you've actually uh, looked and priced fountains that are actually made out of the cement, etc. They can be five hundred thousand dollars. This is one sixty seven eighteen. And by the way, how much does this weigh? Because this is done in resin. Sure, it is a, just a right around twenty pounds without water. Yeah, and perfect. then of course when you fill it with the water, which this basin is a very large basin. Yeah. It will hold quite a bit of water in it. Mm -hmm. And what I suggest for you is when you do get this home, you think, how do I, what, how do I care for it? Right? Right. The only thing that I would suggest for you to do is birds like fresh water. So yeah. dump it out every mm -hmm. so many days if you're having really hot 
weather, yeah. then you want to make sure that you dump that water out and, yeah. and just rinse it out with a hose and fill it back up again. Mm -hmm. And then you're good to go. I wow. keep mine out until the temperatures drop below 40. Yeah. Although I kind of got mine out early this year and I wasn't <laughs> expecting us to have those cold yeah. nights, right? <laughs> exactly. There was it's a couple okay. of frosts and my husband was worried about his plants, <laughs> you know. <laughs> yeah. Now, by the way, on that picture you're seeing on your screen, you're getting a chance to see the two colors kind of almost yeah. side by side, the antique gold and the patina copper. So you decide which one you want. Here's the other thing that I wanted to ask was what kind of assembly, like how difficult sure. is it to put this together? It probably will take you longer to pull it out of the box than it will to assemble. <laughs> It, I, honestly, I always yeah. say that because you package them nicely for yeah. them to arrive at your door. Yeah. You pull them out of the box. The base is one piece. Then you twist and lock that bird bath on. And then you twist and lock this. Let me just turn this around because here is where you can kind of see everything that's going on at the very top. Yeah. Well, I don't know if you can really see in that hole, but that's where yeah. your motor is that's right mm -hmm. there. And the water kind of feeds through and underneath this and then feeds up a tube that yeah. goes right up to your top finial right. that's there. And then the line is fed all the way through and it's about a nine foot cord yeah. for you. So it makes it really nice, but you can also get an extension if you want to put this you know, somewhere mm -hmm. out into your garden. Yeah. That's I mean, look at how absolutely stately that that looks. Mm -hmm. Like it's just, you paid a ton of money for yeah. a gorgeous fountain. Right. And I'll tell you, just to yeah. remind you, Bernini is the name in fountains yes. here at QVC. And we get them in all different sizes and stands and tabletops and whatever. But I will say the fountain I have right now here, the Calvary, and the Tory is the one we had in the last show and that was battery operated, they were both absolutely gorgeous and right around yes. the same price and very similar in size. This might be just about an inch or two larger. Um, the patina copper, six dozen remain, and in the antique gold that Ginger has, fewer than 150. And um, like we said, don't leave it out in the winter. Don't let it stay out and freeze because water, right. when it becomes ice, will could break it so you don't want to do that but i think it's stunning and the best part is so listening I. to it listen calm peaceful isn't that beautiful ginger so thank calming. you so yeah. very very You're much very welcome, it's honey bun. beautiful <laughs> wow okay have a, have a great day babe all right we are going to whoops we're going to continue with Garden Reflections, and this is my pick of the